What is good YouTube, it's your boy Gary, AKA and Gary Trust, coming to you guys again with another video. And this video is gonna be a little different. I'm actually going to be answering the questions where I'm pretty sure some of you guys are thinking like, what is quarantining like in South Florida? To be honest, there's not really any much quarantine going on in South Florida, unfortunately, because people are not following the rules, they're not staying there at home. Like, oh my gosh, I go on Instagram, there's uh, people still having kickbacks down here. I got invited to a couple and obviously I'm staying home. Beaches are still, beaches are closed and people are still on the beach. So I honestly don't know how that works because people literally like go to the beach every single day in Florida. Like um, I live in Palm Beach County and there's not really like a crazy curfew except for Palm Beach Island. And that's because Trump actually lives on Palm Beach Island around the mar a area. And um, I believe the curfew around that area is nine o'clock. Um, I actually live 25 minutes away from Trump, which I never really comprehend. Like that's pretty crazy. I live 25 minutes away from the president. And um, I live about an hour away from uh, Miami and um, probably like an hour 20 from South Beach. So like, I kind of live in like a really good location where it's like I'm kind of in the center of everything. Like Orlando is, I think, like only about three hours away. So it's not too crazy away. And um, yeah, I wish I wish people took this thing more seriously. Like I still see on Instagram people like sharing like sharing blunts and all that stuff. I'm like, yo, come on, bro. Like this is Literally, and plus, like, what I think the most like distasteful thing I've seen on Instagram is people in Pompano like getting lit on ninety five, closed on ninety five, just to have a party, saying, "Oh, we not scared of the coronavirus." And I'm like, y'all make Floridians look horrible. And the thing was, what, what's bad is that usually when you go to like New York or Cali and people act in a fool, they're not from there. But when people act a fool in Florida, they actually are from Florida, which is pretty pretty sad. But though I guess like the one thing where I say like when people like are acting up around spring break is they're not usually from from Florida. I'll I'll vouch for that. People who are crazy on spring break are not from Florida. But, um, as far as Florida goes, uh, restaurants are still open for takeout. Um, I would say the roads are there's not really any traffic, but there's still like kind of like a lot of cars on the streets. It sucks, and um, I can't. The only, only thing is I've been staying home. I actually have like what I want to say two jobs but technically at three locations and they're all closed because they're all in the mall so malls are closed um some barber shops are actually still open like my barber just hit me today saying that like you can come to the shop if you want but it's like eh just not trying to take the risks even though i really do need a cut badly and i'm, I'm pretty sure um he's probably maybe gonna just come over here and give me a cut so just taking this as serious and it's florida as it really sucks like like on i-95 the highway um, a video did come out of people in like Pompano, which is in the Broward area. That's actually where I was born. Not Pompano specifically, I was born in Tamarack, but Broward area. They're not taking it, definitely not taking it as serious as it's supposed to be because my um my my dad, his friends actually just said that um they were having a barbecue by their garage and of course cops shut it down it was past ten o'clock unless they started getting writing out tickets. And um as far as Palm Beach, there's not really a specific curfew. I know Delray just put a like a little statement that you have to be home by midnight. Which is not really considered like a crazy curfew, but I'm but I'm pretty sure if you're standing outside like with your homies at like ten or eleven o'clock and a cop sees you, I'm pretty sure he's gonna tell you how to go the hell home. Um, but yeah, hopefully uh, I'm actually recording this on uh, April Fool's Day, and this is not a joke, unfortunately. But um, yeah, so yeah, but just stay home, stay inside because even if you, you no one knows it like if they have it or not, and just be cautious of others. Just like think about others when you're going outside. Um. I still go outside just to a lap around my neighborhood. I live in a big neighborhood, so it's like not that bad. Um, and my house, thankfully, is like is a good size, so I don't really feel like too like trapped in here. But one thing that this quarantine is definitely teaching me is that to be a lot more appreciative of like everyday life, like going to the beach or even just going to work. Like I don't think anyone's gonna be upset about going to work for a while, <laughs> even though everyone's doing takeout. But even like my mom is like saying like I wouldn't really advise you to eat out from anywhere right now. So that's why like my parents have been cooking a lot. And um, yeah, but you know, I'm still trying to find stuff to do. Like, obviously, I'm pumping out these videos for you. Um, uh, trying to work up on my editing and um, Call of Duty. And uh, yeah, so just telling everyone, especially from Florida, stay your ass home. I know the beach is amazing. I know you miss your friends, but just FaceTime them for now. It's only it's April. Hopefully, I know like because I know Trump just like put out like a stay at home order, um, not forcing us, just advising us to stay at home until like, I think April 30th. So I'm pretty sure after. I want to hit to Maine. Pretty sure some some like spots are definitely gonna open. More of malls probably gonna open up again, and yeah. So that's basically the video. Um, quarantine in Florida is, I guess, kind of different from everywhere else because there's, I guess you can say there's like a little bit more freedom here. 
But um, yeah, so I just, I just advise everyone just stay at home. And yeah, it's your boy Gary, aka Gary we Trust. This is the end of the video, and hope you guys uh, stay safe out there. So I'm out. Y'all take care, all right?